Here's your tea. Thank you. Pour a little more bourbon in. I was so beautiful in college. Of course, I didn't think I was beautiful then, but when I look at my pictures and I see how young I was, how my skin just glowed like I swallowed a light, nothing brings that back. Not the alpha hydroxy, not the laser, not the peels. Oh, how adorable. It's a little pretend fireplace. Oh, well, that's just for decoration. Oh, it's so clever. George loved a fire. He used to love to sit in front of the fireplace when it was snowing out. And he'd say, this is our nest. Nothing can get to us. And then he'd fly off to Aspen to ski. I wonder if I should eat something. I'll see what I have in the fridge. I always hated the word nest. Made me feel like a hen. Of course, I'll never hear that word again. Nest. Well, you still have the house and the fireplace and memories. Yes, but that's not a nest. George was actually the nest. Without George, it's just a big house. And I don't understand the purpose of memories. Do you have any little thing like cheese? I think I do. Oh, good. Brie would be nice. Or Stilton, if you have it, and maybe a beer and some kind of water biscuit. I'll just have it there with my tea. Oh, it's so cozy here. It's so small and shabby and nesty. Oh, well, I'm going to get new carpet as soon as I cover Oh, no, the no, don't change a thing. I love it like this. Uh, do you live here alone? I, I've forgotten. Were you married? Uh, I, yes, I still am, or rather, I am again. Oh, good, because it's perfect for two people. Children would make it feel crowded. Yes, well, Tom and I couldn't have children, so it isn't a problem. I don't have Brie <laughs> or Stilton. I have beer and American cheese. Oh, well, then, no beer. I only wanted it for the Stilton. 